I hope you are enjoying my videos on cross-dressing and forced feminization. Please subscribe to the channel so we can continue to grow together. If you like cross-dressing, bras, panties, wigs, dresses, skirts, makeup, and more, this is the channel for you. Happy cross-dressing. A few weeks had passed since Andrew had transformed into Holly for a tennis match against Lisa. The memory of that day still brought a smile to their faces, and they often joked about it. One Friday evening, while they were having dinner, Lisa had an idea. You know, Holly was a hit on the tennis court, she said, grinning. How about we take her to the beach tomorrow? Andrew looked up, surprised. You want me to dress as Holly again? Yes, Lisa said, her eyes twinkling with mischief. But this time, in a two-piece bikini. Andrew laughed, shaking his head. You're really pushing your luck, you know that? Come on, it'll be fun. Lisa insisted. And besides, you looked great as Holly. Think of it as another adventure. After a bit of playful banter, Andrew agreed. The next morning, they went shopping for a bikini. Lisa picked out a cute, teal two-piece that would accentuate Holly's figure. They also bought a matching cover-up, a pair of flip-flops, and a wide-brimmed hat. Back at home, Lisa helped Andrew get ready. She had him shave his legs nice and smooth, along with the rest of his body. He slipped into the bikini, feeling a mix of nerves and excitement. The top hugged his chest comfortably, and the bottom sat snugly on his hips. Lisa applied some light makeup, similar to the tennis match, and adjusted the blonde wig on his head. Finally, she handed him a pair of sunglasses to complete the look. When they were finished, Holly stood in front of the mirror, looking both playful and stylish. I have to admit, Andrew said, examining his reflection, Holly does look pretty good. You look amazing, Lisa said, smiling. Now let's hit the beach. They arrived at the beach, and Holly took a deep breath, feeling the sun on her skin and the sand beneath her feet. The initial nervousness began to fade as they found a spot to set up their towels and umbrella. Lisa pulled out a beach bag filled with sunscreen, snacks, and a beach ball. They spent the morning lounging in the sun, chatting, and enjoying the sound of the waves. Holly felt more relaxed than she had anticipated, and Lisa's constant encouragement helped ease any lingering anxiety. Eventually, they decided to take a dip in the ocean. The cool water was refreshing, and Holly found herself laughing and splashing around with Lisa. They played in the waves, their worries melting away in the sun. A few curious glances came their way, but most people were too absorbed in their own activities to pay much attention. As the day went on, they walked along the shoreline, collecting seashells and taking in the beauty of the beach. Holly even posed for a few photos, striking playful poses and embracing the fun of the moment. Holly was unaware of the time spent in the sun as the day went on, not realizing that she would have definite tan lines when this day was over. In the late afternoon, they decided to build a sandcastle, working together to create an impressive structure complete with turrets and a moat. As they admired their handiwork, Holly couldn't help but feel a sense of accomplishment. She had stepped out of her comfort zone once again and discovered a new level of confidence and joy. As the sun began to set, casting a golden glow over the beach, Holly and Lisa sat together on their towels, watching the waves roll in. I have to say, this has been an amazing day, Holly said, smiling at Lisa. I'm glad you think so, Lisa replied, squeezing Holly's hand. You were incredible today. I'm proud of you for embracing Holly and making the most of it. Thanks, Holly said, feeling a warmth that went beyond the sun's rays. I couldn't have done it without you. They packed up their belongings and headed home, both feeling content and happy. As they walked, Holly realized that these experiences had brought them closer and had helped her discover new facets of her personality. Back at home, Andrew changed out of the bikini, 
It was then that he realized the sun had left very deep tan lines from the bikini. Lisa laughed. Good luck explaining those tan lines when you go to the gym. Andrew washed off the makeup, but the confidence and sense of adventure remained. He knew that while Holly might only make occasional appearances, the lessons learned and the memories made would stay with him forever. He didn't know it, but Lisa had many adventures in mind for Holly. Before they went to sleep that night, Lisa handed Andrew a pink baby doll nightie and a pair of matching pink panties. I want you to wear these to bed tonight, Holly, she said with a smile. Andrew stepped into the panties and slipped on the nightie and wondered what else Lisa had in mind for Holly. And so, another chapter of their unique journey came to an end, with the promise of more adventures to come, each one bringing them closer and adding more joy to their lives.